for this first scrum. Here we go. 18 extra, okay, extra Italy. large jerseys collide. Italy told to use it, and it's through Brex they go. Now Garbisi, lovely dummy. There's space on the wing if, if it can just be used. There as well. So it's a good solid scrum initially, and then it's the nice hands, the link play round, and then the beautiful long ball. Still work to do there. And Kozhukaru for Romania. Caution there for collapsing. Got BC finding Ioane and Monte Ioane is at it again. The man who cannot stop scoring for Italy. With 14, but this just made it look so easy. It's the little scoot and then that fix. Last defender has to turn in. Every inch counts at test level. And now, how about this break from Halafi? He finds his man in support. Alessandro got BC. Will he score? Yes! He will! They love him getting to see it in slow mo and it's that hard work, those hard lines through one defender, two defender. Okay, then great uh, footwork, now, yeah. offload back inside. The and yeah. there's still work. And Italy back into the pockets. The Touch. left boot of Garbisi charged down almost by Konake. Capuzzo with his footballing skills manages to gather the ball. He's got acres of space. And Italy's blockbuster pixie is at it again. It's like he's never been away. Player you are. If you've been out injured, coming back onto, you know, there's a lot of pressure, especially with the impact he has on this team. But it's a charge down kick, so you feel like Romania had done well initially, but then it's just picked up by Cavutio and just such good pace as well on it. Again, he's not even. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Luke Pierce allows them to play on Lamaro. Sat down, but still managing to dish that one out wide. The ball is down. And it is Nico Terra. Right. Romania in the best attacking position, arguably, they have had all afternoon. They're six metres out now, and the gears begin to grind. One stop. Yellow shirts rumbling onwards. The heavies go to work. Shunt after shunt, the hand goes up, and crucially, just that player with green strapping around his sock. Time today, they have something okay. to smile about. We were asked what they could get from it, and, and it's moments like this. It's being able to say, yeah, scored against a, fan, a team that's playing fantastically. Michele Lamara, the Italian yeah. skipper, is on, on the naughty Romania. step right now, sweating onto that cheap plastic chair. Paolo Garbisi looks for assistance, realises he doesn't need it. Scanning, always scanning the playmaker. Picks up Brax on his inside and it's a cruise home. <laughs> for the outside centre. That just credit to the support players uh, in that, but great work scanning around, having a look already and then it's absolute pace. Desperate tap tackles trying to come in, but you know, he's got three options here. Could go to any player and actually just nice. He takes the easy option on the on the inside. The nice uh, pass. He can't get. The and now Lamaro charging through. You can see the fatigue in his legs there as he's brought down. Advantage. There's the advantage. The handbrake can come off Italy. And now Halafihi frees a hand. Capuzzo. Will he have his second? <laughs> oh yes, he will. A really nice finish there. They've got numbers. They've actually got themselves at first, I thought, a little bit too flat, uh, which is why there was a lot of pressure on that pass, but then good handling and footwork now. And you've got to say, even though we love seeing him run and we love seeing him score tries, for me, I'm starting to think, get him off. Get him off. When you've had six months out injured, trying to play gameplay, sprinting, doing all that dynamic stuff, your body's going to really feel it. So actually, I'd say, well done. The tackler remaining in the fray. It gives Italy, who have a good overlap here, if they can just use it, an advantage to play with. Lamaro draws his man, sends it out wide. And it's delight to Fordino. His second appearance for the Azuri, and he's got himself a try. Here come the Italians, hungry for that ninth score, which was just snatched away from them. Ball was out, ball was out. Phase after phase, they string it together. Patient, repeated effort. Alafihi has it now. That's the try.